plants living and surviving the place where a plant lives is called its habitat plants live in different surroundings they have to adjust according to the conditions of the environment this process of adjustment is called adaptation the conditions which are necessary for the growth of plants are type of soil amount of water available temperature of the place amount of rain availability of light and wind plants are classified depending on their habitat terrestrial plants which grow on land and aquatic plants which grow on water terrestrial plants plants which are grown in plain areas hilly areas hot and damp places desert areas and marshy areas are known as terrestrial plants plants grown in plains these are deciduous trees meaning they shed their leaves annually example mango tree shisham tree neem tree etc plants of hills these are coniferous trees meaning the tree produces cones and evergreen needles they are tall with thick and woody stem example is a pine tree cone tree etc plants of hot and damp places these plants are also known as evergreen plants as they do not shed their leaves they need plenty of water and sunlight and are found near the sea coast near the sea coast the temperature is hot and humid example pepper tree cotton tree etc plants of deserts in the desert very few plants can be seen the reason is less rainfall desert plants have spines which helps to prevent loss of water example cactus plant palm plant etc plants of marshes the area near the seashore is known as marshy area this area is wet and humid with plenty of water the plants grown in marshes are called mangroves the roots of mangroves can be seen out as they cannot breathe inside the soil these roots are also called breathing roots example of a mangrove is a carrier plant plants of as family grass is also a plant which germinate flower bamboo is an example of a jain grass which is used in making houses paper and furniture wheat rice maize jowar bajra etc are examples of plants that belongs to the grass family Let us learn about the aquatic plants. There are three types of aquatic plants. They are floating plants, fixed plants, and underwater plants. Let us begin with floating plants. Floating plants are those that float on water and they are small in size and light in weight. Example: duckweed water lettuces etc fixed plants these plants are fixed to the water bed and they have long hollow stems which supports the large leaves and flowers to float example water lily lotus underwater plants these plants are also known as submerged plants as they remain under water the roots are fixed at the bottom of the water body they do not have stomata and breathe through the body surface example hydrilla pondweed tape grass etc now let us discuss some rare plants one of its kind is an insectivorous plant 
plants which do not get proper minerals to survive such plants eat insects to fulfill their mineral requirement these are called insectivorous plants these plants trap and eat insects example venus fly trap sundew plant pitcher plant pitcher plant closes its lid as soon as the insects in it some plants cannot prepare their own food and are dependent on the dead and decaying plants and animals example is a mushroom plant 